Hello, friends. Welcome back. I guess I could have tagged you all. Nobody said shit in the chat, though, so how was I to know? How was I to know we're back with the uh, evening edition of Underground Case Breaks, I suppose. I suppose we're going to call it the evening edition. Uh, I don't even know where my video is at. <laughs> I hate Facebook. It's so terrible on computer. On desktop, it's just atrocious. Terrible. But I am going to tag you guys real quick because I'm a nice guy. And then we'll randomize teams. Chad, Satterlin, Jonathan, Eastridge, Johnny, DeVoe, my man Bill. Larley coming to hang out and do some best with us. Jerry Bernie needs some, some new, new, new luck. Or however we want to go about that. Uh, Blake. Coster. I don't even know what this Eltingville. Jeez. What the hell kind of town is that, Jimbo? You need to upgrade, bud. Oh, that's not it either. Austin, Vasky, Mario. Mario's back. Sam Lanzo. Yalarly. Yo, I almost pirate noised at you. I don't, I don't know what I was about to do. But my mouth opened up, sounds came out, and it's not what I thought it was going to be. So we, we just, we stopped that right away. Justin Sanders. Sorry, I'm going to tag everybody. I started doing it. Uh, Michael, just a few more. Jay Lyons. I was sitting around wondering why I was ready so early in my intro video. <laughs> Now I know why. Scott Karazic Radio. He's back. Sean South Pole. Back to what's up, friends? Uh, let's switch screens. Let's do the random. I already partially set it up here with uh, the left side column. Uh, we already got this going on. I got a ton of things open. What is this? This is my preview, guys. Series 1 preview. I'm listing tomorrow. So if you guys want a sneak preview of pricing... I'm going to post it up when I make the post anyway. It'll be tonight. But this is uh, Series 1 Jumbo. It's what it's going to look like price-wise. I haven't finalized it yet. I'm going to look through the checklist one more time here later tonight. But uh, I, I changed my mind today, this morning. We're going to post it up tomorrow and sell what we can. And then uh, see how it goes. Because uh, how things go are going to depend on what we do. So here we go, teams. Make sure it's 29. Same thing from this morning. 11. Uh-oh, I'm going to roll the crap out of these. Here we go. Do, 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 do. Just, you know, sit around for a minute. While we scroll and scroll. Just remember, friends, you picked the numbers. I just shuffled the teams. Orioles on top. Are they? Were they on top last time? Pretty sure Baltimore was on top last time. Sean, you should have stayed, bud. Padres on bottom isn't the worst, but it's not 2019 anymore. Oh, man. Here we go. 140. What is this? 249. I really need to get a better numbering system for breaks. Oh, I need some paint action. What's everybody doing? Just being quiet. I don't like it. I don't like it. 2.49. This is like after hours for me. So I don't like all this quiet. You guys got to talk more. More talking. Por favor. Twitter, by the way. Holy cow. Twitter is destroying you, Facebook. 1,840. I got like 1,400 followers today. Giving away one box of series. Look at this shit. It's bananas. Absolutely bananas what's going on. We almost have the Independence Day. Three likes away from the old 1776. God bless America. And fucking Twitter is kicking Facebook right in the dick right now. So uh, I don't know how to explain that to you guys. But be better. I never thought that would happen. Holy cow. They want me over at Twitter. Said come to Twitter. Look at this shit. This is the business page. Sorry, this has nothing to do with the break. It's just a giveaway, so I'm promoing a giveaway right now. If you don't like free things, then piss off. 2,500 people reached. That's it. I got a ton of likes. 1,500 likes, and I've, I've had this business page for three years. This is what we're doing numbers-wise. You guys are looking at my 
numbers. 63 shares. That's like a retweet. 63 shares. That's it. I built this business on Facebook. And then you come over here to Twitter and it's just saying, <laughs> oh, look at this, look at this tweet activity here. 101,000 impressions with 9,000 engagements. And then over here we're just <laughs> pissing into the wind on Facebook. Oh my goodness. Shout out to everybody though, helping out, helping the cause. I'm not shitting on you guys, I'm just, Twitter's just a more friendly place i think facebook is not the friendliest of places anyway enough of this nonsense let's get back to the teams i just that was the shocker of the day and i'm absolutely stunned by what's going on over there on twitter today twitter famous kevin b he called me out too mm, mm, twitter i don't even know what that means i can't even keep up i'm trying to like all the people that like if you're gonna take the time to say something like, uh, when you retweet the tweet, I at least give you the time of day and like your post. I know what it's like to be like, hey, man, maybe I tweet so-and-so or mention so-and-so and to have them not respond. So, like, man, give everybody a little shout-out, you know? A little, little like your tweet. You might not win the giveaway, but, I mean, I'm out here talking. <laughs> Good luck. Guess you know your proper... Your... I just, man, it's wild. It blows my mind. Spent three years on Facebook doing nothing. But it's all the way Facebook's built around groups and things of that nature. It's just a different it's a different animal. But I'm gonna leave the teams on the screen. My employee's gone for today, so I gotta go to I gotta walk my fat ass to the printer. So give me just a second, folks. We'll do that and then we'll get into it. Oh you fancy, huh? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Apparently, fancier than I thought. Do, 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 do. Sorry guys, long walk. Long walk. I don't know. Uh, my cardio is not there for all that walking. Oh, I'm totally just kidding. What's up, guys? We're back. I'll throw it up on the screen too. I'm just saying, Twitter. Twitter loves a good giveaway. I always bitch because Facebook's like, it's really hard to do giveaways on Facebook. Especially if you don't, like, hold the person's hand and fucking do it all for them. If they have to, like, respond to the results or anything, good luck. Good luck. Hey, friends. I don't know what you guys are doing tonight, but cheers. If this, is, if this half has the hits... What worries me is the last half had two golds and an atomic. That's what worries me, Bill. I don't know what's about to happen in these four boxes. Sorry, this is some good gumball head from my, my dear friends at Three Floyds who have also never said anything to me. But uh, if they ever decided they wanted to send uh, B-Rad some brewskis to drink while he breaks, I'd be more than happy to make that happen best beer on planet earth moscow mules all right who did the front ceos get tonight uh the royals and the marlins <laughs> you're gonna need to make them like a double you know <laughs> double them bad boys up i have some great teams bill you did better than last time huh what are we at the strohs i love Jordan. i love them criminally undervalued tigers doyers one more, one more, and the Mets. Billy and the Mets. Ha <laughs> ha! Cowbell. All right, friends. Time to break. Time to break. I play music, but Facebook will copyright the shit out of me. That's what they do. They'll just silence your video. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I made it too. That was nice.
Good luck, everyone. I appreciate it. Oh, I'd appreciate it more if I get get this going on here. Like I said, Series 1 is coming. I can't sit on the sidelines anymore and watch all the Series 1 fill before B-Rad gets his, his hat in the, the ring. Harper, Sitsugo, Alvarez, Power Producers, Tyler Soderstrom, Athletics, Kirazic. There you are, sir. Good power. I like these inserts this year. They're nice. I mean, they make nice inserts every year. The Neophyte Sensation ones from previous best years are some of the best inserts they've ever done. They do some nice inserts and best. Bona Alvarez. Key Brian Hayes. We're going to have an Aquino refractor for the Reds. Who do you guys think the, the best rookies are here in... Uh, for Series 1 purposes, I should say. Because you know how that goes. It's not always... Uh, those people are not always rookies come real baseball. But, like, you know, you got Pache, Bohm, Adele, Mount Castle. Who's the fifth guy? Who's the fifth guy? You know what I mean? That's the question. Who are the, who are the top five guys for Series 1? Trent Grisham, rookie refractor. I like my team for the first half better. Johnny DeVoe, who'd you get, brother? The Rangers, the Reds, the Brewers, and the Braves. Well, one wild Acuna might change your mind, but I, I agree. You know, Bone Patch, eh? Carlson, yeah, okay. Yeah, you could do that. Six, though, for sure, but pitchers just aren't valuable. It's wild. To say that out loud. <laughs> Look at this shit, man. I'm sorry, guys. This is what scares me. We already hit a Logan Webb base autograph. Out of this case. We've already done it. Why do we need to do this again? Whew. I don't like that. Yeah, Dylan Carlson. Dylan Dylan. Carlson. Nico Horner having atomic polar bear. I don't know if that's extra cold or... Or what? Sounds cool. An atomic polar bear. What about that cat kid from the Mets? He's with the Indians. Jimenez. Anybody? Anybody forget about Andre Jimenez? I like him. Not. I don't love him. You know what I mean. But I like his potential. Madger going from the White Sox just because he has no power. He's getting. He's getting Jeff McNeil already. Guy hit like 330 last year. Nobody even cares. Love the hobby. Cronenworth. He's not a he's not a rook, rookie card, is he? Uh, Luis Robert Emerson Hancock, franchise favorites, number to 250. Insert autograph for the Mariners. Seattle. Seattle. Where are they? I don't see Seattle them anywhere. See what I did there? Boom. Luis Robert, power producers. Dun, 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 dun. I just figured I'd ask you guys your opinions on the matter. I'm going to have a price preview uh, real soon for uh, the cases tomorrow. I'm going to post that up after this break. I already dropped it in the realist room just because I made a post yesterday in there. But uh, we'll make an underground post here real soon. And then website listings, Facebook listings. Uh, we're listing everywhere tomorrow. It's going to be a listing bonanza. These are some of the most beautiful cards, guys. The next hit's huge, too. You can see it right there before somebody shows up at the door because it's a beauty. These atomic uh, country cards are just spectacular. I hate the Dodgers. I hate Gavin Lux. But this card is just spectacular. The Nico Horner one's dope too, and I can't stand him either. Gavin Lux. Nice hit for the Dodgers. I I don't know what it goes for. Don't, that's just a cool card. 
And our next hit. Who's got him, anyway? Who's got him? Oh, shit. That's not the door. That's just more cowbell. More cowbell. Keith Francino. Oh, yeah, baby. We're getting fired up now. Here you go, sir. Blue Refractor, Kansas City Royals. Number 150, Bobby Witt Jr. Yes, sir. Maybe you don't need to double up on the Moscow Mule now, friend. Here you go. Here's to you. Cheers, babe. It's so refreshing. So refreshing. Nice hit. McNeil hits 25. Hey, I, I don't disagree. The hobby's the one that disagrees. Him, Ozzy Albies, nobody cares for those those types of guys. Uh, there's some other ones, I'm, I'm sure, but... There's a, a, a group of uh, Whit Merrifield. There's a group of fantastic baseball players that the hobby just doesn't care about. At all. And it's disgusting. But I... Half the guys people care about now aren't going to the Hall of Fame. So what's it matter? Why can't a good ball player get his shine while he's good? Not everybody's going to be good for 15 fucking years. So... You know, if a guy wants to be good for five years, why does that have to get, like, disregarded? I hate having a random list on the screen. It blocks everything. You're welcome, buddy. You're welcome. Peche Akiyama, Bryce Hapa. Robert Hassel, Padres. Who, who had him? Sean, there you go, bud. Hit both breaks, I believe. Yeah, Rutschman and now Hassel. Man. Man, look at you. Robert Hassel. I like it. Nico. Boom. Verlander. Oh, but I mean, that's most shortstops. There's not too many rookies in this class who are going to be remembered for their bat. I mean, Madrigal is going to have the highest average of everyone. Bohm is probably the best complete batter. Adele needs to go to the minor leagues, so I don't even know why he's on the fucking hype train. Uh, Pat Che, same thing, defense first. Mountcastle's another guy that could be the you know up there with Bohm for hitting talent that doesn't ever translate. We'll see when they play games. We'll revisit series one when update comes out, and we'll see how silly everyone was. Hey Zeus Lizardo, refractor autograph for the Athletics. And I mean none of these guys could be anybody. Who knows yet? We don't know yet. That's why they played a the game. I'm excited. Purple, AJ Puck. Hey, kiddo, are you loving this weather? Sure am, Dad. I'm right inside where I need to be. It's been snowing all day here. Sorry, he texts me. My phone like tells me my text. Like that kid, the castle guy. You know, Ryan, mount your castle. I'd like a super factor or something. Just, you know, personal preference. Buy me some peanuts and cracker jacks. We're going to get another autograph at the end of this pack because it's going to be Austin Wells. I hate the Yankees. Uh, Justin Sanders, there you go, sir. You're on the board. Austin Wells. Did I see him on the Series 1 checklist for the Yanks? I thought I did. Because I really don't know much about him. No, it's Albert Abreu. Sorry. Sorry. He's a pitcher anyway. I was, I was like, uh, I saw a few names on the checklist. I'm like, what? Carlson's going to hit fucking 250 at best. And he's going to be like every other big Cardinals prospect in the last... Five to ten years. Jared Kilnick for the Mariners, number to 50. 
I mean, Paul DeYoung was supposed to be the fucking man. What's he doing? Then you had that fucking master baiter. He ain't done anything. Then you had Salsa Boy break his wrist. I don't want to hear about the Cardinals. Kelnick, nice gold refractor. Gavin Lux in there as well. Adele, the polar bear. I'm more excited in terms of Cardinals. Fucking Hicks getting back to pitching. Alex Reyes, is he still on the team? The checker ain't done. Shoot. Tyler O'Neill. All right, all them turds. I don't want to hear about your Redbirds, friend. Talk, tell them to talk to me when they start doing stuff. I stay salty, babe. Got to. Miles Michaelis was supposed to be the next big fucking thing. We're going to get one of those inverse. Zach Gallon followed by Bobby Bradley. Just fantastic rookie autographs coming out of this case, friends. Just next level, otherworldly rookie talent. Uh, 2021 baseball will start Wednesday and really starts tomorrow for the chosen few breakers that Topps secretly loves with all their heart. Hashtag still salty. Zach Gallon case uh, one of two case per case inverse refractor things. Uh, yeah, one product has already come out. It's absolutely terrible. Uh, it's my most watched YouTube video ever. It's atrocious. Uh, Ronald Acuna Atomic, but tomorrow or Wednesday is uh, Series 1. Tops flagship product. Ronald Acuna Jr. Atomic Refractor. That'll be Wednesday. We'll be cracking all sorts of cases of that. And yeah, that, that's about it. Then we'll just start going from there. Like, let's see. Let's, let's look on that calendar. So we get Series 1. Then Onyx Nimbus Baseball on the 15th. I will never order another Onyx product ever. I got a redemption from them. And when they redeemed it, I had to pay postage when it fucking showed up. For my redemption from Onyx. Way to run your company, dickheads. Uh, Leaf Lumber Kings Baseball. Leaf Flash Baseball. Leaf Valiant Baseball. Don Russ Baseball is really the next baseball release and that's march 3rd so this is really the only baseball release for the month so we'll be cracking it as long as we can fill it uh and then march is when when things kick off inception heritage opening day are all the same day sterling top sterling which is super high end is the week after definitive is the week after that also gigantically uh high end then gypsy queen is early april with tribute and then bowman is what all the all the cool kids want. So, uh, no, no, I'm not starting Tuesday. No, you have to be at top special little party. I'm not. I didn't get invited. We knocked on the door. You know what I mean? Or we tried to knock on the door. Yeah, Panini. It's like that. Top's license is till 2025, I believe. And then I mean, it'll probably get renewed. Panini just got uh, MMA. They got the UFC. So, uh, I think that's a gigantic acquisition that nobody's talking about right now. Garrett Mitchell for the Brewers. Like it's it's huge. MMA is bigger, like has more of a following than the NFL does on like Instagram and most social media. Anywhere you go, it's just a matter of time before MMA cards catch up at all. I'm also just a huge MMA guy, so sports growing. Vladdy Jr. Purple Refractor. Nico Horner, Franchise 2020, Bobby Witt. The Blue Jays could make some noise this year. Julio Rodriguez. I'm not starting Tuesday. I'm just posting Tuesday. So I'll be pre-selling. Andres Munoz for the Padres. Number 150 blue refractor rookie autograph. Just terrible rookie autographs. You think of, the, of them having three or four good rookies, they would at least put like one. Like they have to be cognizant of who the desirable rookies are. You would think they would at least try and do it to where you got at least one in a case. As a line, 
Atomic, Matt Chapman, Fish, Fish, Angels, Fish. Gavin Lux, franchise favorites. That one did not guard. Crochet, Wit, Acuna, Hassel, Casey Schmidt. I mean, really. Webb and Munoz. Yeah, we hit Webb earlier, too. Earlier this afternoon. Casey Schmidt for the Giants. I, I mean, I can't get excited about that. How am I going to get fired up over it? Webb and Munoz. Pua, son. <laughs> More like. Poop, son. Freeman, Hancock, Justin Dunn. Kind of what I expected, though, friends. Torque and Mladzinski. Good grief. Good grief. This stuff's too expensive to do this. I'm sorry. You guys are probably not as mad as I am. It's ridiculous. Gonna get a nice Alvarez refractor. Orange. Oh, baby. One out of 25. Trent Grisham for the Padres. Orange Refractor Rookie Card. The South Pole is working out, Sean. Damn. Damn. Bryce Harper, Atomic. And there's a Jordan Refractor. It's a good pack of cards. I can't get jiggy to this shit, man. <laughs> oh, gosh. That movie's hilarious. <laughs> Oh, fuck, he's like, I'm crying and shit. I uh, can't, I can't talk about it on camera. Oh, there's that, that guy. Alvarez franchise favorites. Last, last box, friends. Last box. Love that you don't hype up terrible hits. Uh, I mean, I'm glad you bought this case and not me. No, no Bill, you bought it. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm glad you guys bought this case and not me. I opened $5,000 worth of wax this weekend. Some football and some basketball. I opened six Prism T-Mall, or six Mosaic T-Mall boxes. I have not opened up anything for me in a very long time. But I needed uh, mid to low end cards. And I did it. I might break even eventually. I got a really nice uh, Gold Wave Zion. But it's a debut. If it wasn't a debut, I wouldn't even be... Man, but I opened up the contenders boxes. I tried to sell you guys because they're atrocious. They were horrible too. Eleven hundred and fifty dollars worth of fucking dog shit. I couldn't even open it. Open it up on camera. Cody Bellinger. Cody Bellinger. Number to ninety nine. Power producers. Insert autograph for the Doyers. Bill. Bill, I'm glad you bought this case bun. Repack coming? Not out of that. No, no, no. Uh, I do have some items for a repack. I give you guys a sneak. Hey, if you guys want a repack sneak preview at the end, you better get noisy in the chat because I got a handful of cards to show you guys that I have been buying specifically for repack purposes. But if I don't get any love in the chat over a repack, then I'm not even going to show you. And I don't know when it's coming. Just I do work on them. I'm just very, uh, I'm very selective in what I buy for repack. So. Those are nothing I ever bought with the intention of, like, pumping out repacks. Forrest Whitley, number to 150. And we have a Boba Shett rookie refractor. Bobby Shoes, what's up, bro? Sneak peek. Oh, yeah, we're going to get the sneak for the peak. Peak for the sneak. Bought some nice stuff. You guys see what I do, though. I always like to have rookie high-end slabs at the top of my repacks. Because the value just goes through the roof. Uh, the middle cards are the cards that are 
lower than the entry fee. Either they need to be rookies, like raw rookies. Bobby Witt Atomic with the Pete Crow Armstrong for the Metropolitans. Shout out to the Mets. The consumer is key. <laughs> show us now. Well, this is what I'm going to show you. The mid-tier cards, they got to be, you know, high-end products. I don't like putting... I don't know. It's very hard to explain. I, I mean, I could. I just have to, like, write it out. I'm not putting... I'd put a high-end Panini card in the top, but it's got to be super dope. Uh, there's just... Very, very picky. That's why they always do well. Just like this Atomic Refractor Robert. This will do well. White Sox. Nice card. Jimbo. 2-2 two two in your repack. See, look at you. We started those. We started doing, re I started doing repacks and then Pav started helping out. Sourcing cards while I was working in the mill. But we started doing that because Wax got so silly. And Wax is still getting silly. So we just repack. 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 How's a box going to be $300? Like, I got a Luminaries card. Box is going to be $300, and then the Luminaries card I got sitting over here, I got a steal on it. But it's like a third of what the box costs. And it's not even a terrible player. It's crazy how this shit works. Sometimes you got to let somebody else do the take the punishment for you and then you just repack it. <laughs> Lois Roberts all over the place. Vladdy Jr. Nick Gonzalez for the Pirates. There we go. Who's got Pittsburgh? Don't look. You know what I mean? Then I come over here. Then I come over here and do it again because I, I don't know who has the Pirates. But I'm pretty sure that's centered. Oh, there we go. I didn't even have to look. I still don't know who has the Pirates. Congratulations to the Pirates, Chad Satterland. There you go, buddy. Nice hit. That Robert in here. Mm. One day you guys will all have sweet, sweet top loading skills like me. But don't try this at home if you don't know what you're doing. Nolan Jones, Bryce Harper. Doop, doop. Doo -doo. I think this next pack is the autograph. Not this one in my hands, but the next one. So we're going to do this. Boom. Put it on the bottom. The whole case is in full of pirates. Johnny, you're 100% correct. Maybe this is the autograph. Maybe I'm just an idiot. I mean, we're really not debating that. That's pretty factual. Uh, Jacob deGrom, uh, number to 250. And a Nick Gonzalez Atomic. It has been a pirate's case if there was ever such a thing. That kind of makes me nauseous to think about. <laughs> Pirates case. <laughs> it's just silly to say out loud. Say it out loud at home. Amongst yourselves. Go ahead. Kyle Lewis. It sounds silly. Torkelson. Rutschman. Kyle Lewis. And the moment you've all been maybe potentially waiting for it's gonna be a base autograph coming in at uh, the bottom of the pile we got the other inverse Jordan and congratulations Giants Patrick Bailey lazy 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 autograph but not a terrible hit Blake Corona turn there you go sir get the Jordan inverse here for the Stroves and that'll do it that'll do it friends we'll do a little sneak peek at the end of the recap here for the repack and then it's uh, Series 1 time, friends. Let's see how that goes. Let's see how this went. Ooh. Watch this. Ooh. Beautiful. Beautiful. Sorry, you guys are going to watch me clean. Ooh. Ooh. It gets so messy. It's a messy Bessie. I mean, maybe I just have a drink too. I'll have another drink. Cheers. It's just refreshing, guys. Alvarez inverse. Patrick Bailey for the Giants. We had Nick Gonzalez refractor for the Pirates. Luis Robert atomic refractor. Pete Crow Armstrong for the Metropolitans. Cody Bellinger eighty nine and ninety nine for the Dodgers. Alvarez refractor. Trent Grisham orange refractor. Mladzinski, Schmidt, 
Blue Munoz, Garrett Mitchell, Inverse, Zach Gallen, Bobby Bradley, Kalanick, Gold, Refractor, Austin Wells, Base, Luzardo, Refractor, Robert Hassel, Blue Refractor, Bobby Witt Jr., we had an Atomic Gavin Lux, Emerson Hancock, Franchise Favorites, Insert Autograph, Logan Webb, and Tyler Soderstrom. And now... What's this card? I don't think that's part of what I wanted to show you. All right, friends. So this is all stuff I bought. Minus this card. This card's not a part of the repack, but it's just so beautiful. I have to show you guys. Oh, oh, the best reprint I've ever seen in my life. It's just spectacular. 2020 Tops Chrome, baby. I love Chrome Relics. I practice what I preach, friends. That's for me forever. Don't at me. Uh, but like, you know. You get a repack and say you, you don't get a spot that's worth your money. Would you really be mad if you got something as fucking sick as Top Sterling Will Clark? Look at all the colors in this. Top Sterling, so expensive. I paid not that much for this card. But you get beautiful stuff like this. Mm. And that's like a card that's going to lose you money. You're going to be mad about that? This probably be another card that will lose you money. You know, got it. This would definitely lose you money. Rookie transcendent fucking Aaron Judge card. Number to 87. You know, that's a terrible card to get. Mm. I mean, sure. You can get stuff like rookie Baez autographs, number to 15. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Then you get other stuff like Luminaries, Don Mattingly, number to 5. I mean,. This is just like throwaway stuff. And then this one's probably a little bit more money though. Oh, Tani here, number to 10. That's quite a bit more money. But this case is shitty. It's all scratched up. But that doesn't hurt the card. We could re-one touch it if you really needed to. But you know, stuff like that I've been scooping up. There's more stuff, but that's all you get for today. That's it. That's right. Alright friends, we'll see you guys later.